video. You can check me out on YouTube at JohnnyVids1. Please hit that subscribe button and like. Today I am doing a video on some of the concept work I draw. I've been working on an Alice in Wonderland themed concept. It's called Alice in the Wonderverse. Some of my artist friends are like, hey John, put some of your uh, artwork up. So this is, a, this is a video for them. And if you like it, please hit that subscribe button and the like button. I really appreciate your support. But right now I'm going to give you some information on it. I started working on this Alice in Wonderland remake. It's called Alice in the Wonderverse. I did it all in black and white. It's uh, done with nothing but pencil. And I've got nine or ten pictures to go along with the story. And um, it's basically the same idea about Alice in Wonderland, only instead of being in Wonderland, she's in multiple universes. And um, I'm going to go ahead and get to the video, go ahead and get to the pictures, and uh, just let y'all see some. It's going to be a short video, but I hope y'all like it. Alright. I'm going to show you some main characters right now. This is <clears throat> the Worm Hare and the Mad Crabber. This is just one of the drawings that I did. And this is... This is Alice... Right here, this is, I yeah, hope y'all can see it. This is Alice right here, fishing off the same cliff that the Mad Crabber and the Worm here were fishing off of. And you see we have this giant squid here is trying to entice Alice with a lollipop, which if you've seen from the first one, the bait that they're using, that's how the squid got the bait. Now, Alice has to get to the Ill of Destruction, and I'll get to... The Ill of Destruction at the very end. But she has to learn knowledge from the Turtle of Knowledge. The only way to get to the Turtle of Knowledge is to ca catch one of these saltwater spheres coming from a storm. Alright, so this is the third page. This is Alice finally reeled in the moon. And she's up there. She's trying to catch one of these spheres and lure off this giant squid. This is the next page with the Turtle of Knowledge. Alice finally caught a spear. She's trying to reach the turtle of knowledge. i give you a good shot of him. Detailing him. She's in the sphere. Alright, she's trying to reach the turtle of knowledge to figure out how to beat the ill of destruction. In a longer journey, she meets some of the basic characters. This is my version of the caterpillar with the hookah. This is the queen. She has to battle four queens. Each queen is a deck of is a is a part of the a, a game of playing cards. This is the queen of clovers here. She has a giant Venus flytrap, and these are her minions. She's in this clover field. So she, in the story, she has to battle the queen of clovers. This is the queen of diamonds. She has to battle the Queen of Hearts and her insect army. This is the Queen of Hearts and her insect army. And the final queen she has to battle is, of course, the Queen of Spades. She has to beat her in a game of chess. So my concept was to see the game through Alice's eyes. And when she beats the Queen of Spades... The Turtle of Knowledge let her know that the Queen of Spades would give her the information on beating the Ill of Destruction. And this is the final scene with the Ill of Destruction. With the Earth and the Ills. And if you can tell, I put so much detail into the scales. And there you have it. That's my 9 or 10 pages of concept art for my Alice in Wonderland theme, Alice in the Wonderverse. And uh, I appreciate y'all subscribing and supporting me on this YouTube thing. It's been a blessing. And I'm doing a little bit of something so everybody can enjoy it. You know what I'm saying? I mainly do pranks and uh, music, musically themed videos. But every once in a while I'm going to throw in some hair coloring and some artwork. Because I just want to wanna reach a, a large fan base. And I just want y'all to know I appreciate everything y'all do for me. Thanks for watching the video.